Hello, folks. Hello. Uh, right now, I'm preparing to go to Watsonville, California. I actually shot a video about a year ago about Watsonville, and I think it's kind of unique place. And what I wanted to do, I just wanted to re revisit it once again and maybe take a better, more in-depth look into the things. So that's where I'm going right now. And honestly, I think places like Watsonville, where the population speaks uh, a language other than English, like in this case, of Spanish. I think we should preserve and care more about such communities because I don't know, it just adds so much uniqueness to the environment that, I don't know, I really like that. Some people might want, like, don't like that, but I personally love it. And it's just like one uh, additional way for me to practice Spanish or at least uh, listen to Spanish. Para escuchar el español. <laughs> ah, está bien. Okay, uh, let's go. Veterans Memorial Building. Oh, interesting. Okay. This one says uh, health for people. Salud para la gente. Okay, perfect. Already interesting. Such interesting houses out there. Oh. And also Mercado. It's like a market, right? You can buy everything for uh, cheaper here and probably more uh, locally grown, I guess. I guess so. Panaderia means bakery, so I can see bakery here, but it's closed. It's Saturday and it's closed, it's strange. Okay, let's go further. Okay, here, it uh, doesn't look good. Okay. So many nice houses here, I like it. I'm just out of nowhere. It says something in English. Seriously. Wow. Wow. Mm, what about this? Ah, is it just a store like this? Mm. Mm, again, express service to Mexico. Mm. Guadalajara is quite far. What? Makes sense. And Tijuana, yes. And all the fresh stuff, I guess, made here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Zero Talk Station English. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. What's here? Uh, here is nothing. Okay. Let's cross the street. Wait. Yeah, and here is the famous plaza. I think it's like the center of the city and it's quite nice. I mean, quite a nice place to gather together. This one says you can legalize your car. Oh, I guess if you like take it from Mexico with the, without proper uh, paperwork, you can just legalize it here. Okay, here's the flowers. Flareria. No, it says flowers. Okay, interesting. You can also buy food right there. Some music is going on here. Some concert, I don't It's interesting, somebody approached me asking like if I want a soup or something, I was hungry. I guess, yeah, kind of desperate situation here, maybe for some people.
convent of Italy somewhere here. That's interesting. Huh. How is it related to this place? Okay, so there is some music going on. All right. Just I don't know, some music store probably. I think I ate once here with the cheap food. Uh, yeah, I don't I don't think I actually like it, but the place is cheap for rent, okay. It's hard to believe there is still a video store here, so you can I don't know, VHS tapes or DVD tapes. I don't know what it's for, but it's a while, it's still here, it's long. This one says do not text while driving, but I think it's quite uh, indicated already. It says secure zone. Okay. Alright, what's here? And again, this is just a second hand shop, I guess. Uh, one more. Yeah, I think it, it, reminds, it reminds of Mexico. But very, very mixed. Oh, and here is a Goodwill. Yeah, Goodwill is a nice store to bring some uh, second hand stuff, but I mean, it's quite rare to find something actually good there. But still, it works for the most part. In this street, okay, nice house here. Not exactly sure what this one says, but I don't know. This one you can uh, rent the mailbox, I guess. Another market here, yeah, supermercado. Uh, okay, interesting. <laughs> well, that's pretty much all I can find in this city. It's, it's, I mean, it's nice, it's beautiful, it's, it's kind of interesting, but uh, at the same time, there's not much to do or see. This chase building is though looks like out of the place, right? It's just totally different style of the building. Very straight up to the point. <laughs> and no decoration at all. <laughs> if you like music, there's also a discoteca Oaxaca right there, so you can enjoy some dance moves there. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay. I think it's possible to understand that people are living cheaply here, people don't earn much money living there, as, as I understand. But I think it's, it's still a lovely place, it's a lovely place to be. I guess very family oriented, like many cities in the US, but this one especially, I guess, yeah. Oh, there's a to-go sandwich place here, with outside seating, which is cool. It's quite... Uh, Hard to find such places with outside seatings. Okay, Boost Mobile. And this is the video store. Huh. Okay. It's interesting that this Chinese Buffet and all other places like Italian Bank looks like out of the place here, right? It doesn't seem like it belonged there. <laughs> so yeah, it's funny. But yeah, it's because it's a very Mexican place, right? Everything, and many signs in Spanish, so why it's even there? I don't know, but it seems to like live all good together. What else can I say? Probably not much, probably not much I can say, besides that, oh, here's a taco place, tacos, 
this is good what else here clearance sale again so many clothes cloth stores second-hand stores and stuff like that supermercados supermarkets again some food store and then and then just a beautiful plaza out there yes okay and the weather is great today actually Okay, one more Mexican restaurant. This one. And the theater on the other side. Finally, I found the theater, which is cool. Yeah. Also, it's a voting day today, so the library is used as a voting place. Oh, and it's also a plaza. Yeah. I like the way how they indicated pedestrians, it's like ducks. Yeah, either way. <laughs> I feel it's not the best way to indicate pedestrians. It's like slowish, slowish people. I think that I should end my tour at this building, this church behind me. Uh, I don't think there's much left to see in Watsonville. It's about all it can offer. I, I mean, just a typical town seems like, but at the same time with some local vibe, which makes, makes it feel, I mean, makes it feel interesting or something like that. Um, yeah, I mean, nothing bad, nothing bad about this place, it's just like different. So yeah, so for me it was it's a good experience. Always come back here almost every few months, just because why not? Uh, yeah, initially I went here to the Chinese buff buffet, which I found very uh, cheap <laughs> compared to other places. And since then I keep coming here just to like look around. Oh, and there's also a beach nearby, like a few miles away, so it can be also checked out. So yeah, interesting place. So guys, if you like this video, please press the like button, subscribe and leave a comment down below. Thank you for watching.